<laughs> but, the, but the thing is, um, I ain't been with that many women. I don't find it easy. And, um, and Deborah, I mean, we're getting married, so. Oh, that's beautiful. But I'm scared that she's going to leave me. I mean, this is her place. And the fornicating? There's Mr. Raspberry Jam. Whoa. Whoa. Now, Mr. Raspberry Jam, he died a noble death. Bringing great joy to a lonely man. I ain't got a very big penis. Some girls laugh when they, when they look at it. Oh, show me. Oh, no. Show me, boy! I, 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 I don't want to. <sighs> Mine ain't nothing special, but this boy gets the job done. All right? Now, Wade here says that you work at the docks. Uh, yes. Look at me! Can you just put your Johnson away, sir? Oh, Jesus. Yes, I work at the docks. And? Anything uh, interesting there for a man like me? Well, I mean, I, I, I don't rightly, rightly know. What kind of person are you? Oh, I'm that kind of person, Floyd. I am that kind of person. Now, let's get you... Wade and that little tormentor down there to put these on. We are going for a ride. Gentlemen, the gateway to America awaits. Run, we got an inside man at the port of LS. I'm gonna send you some information. I need you on point to help plan things. I got it, T. I really miss... You know where the... Access. No entiendo. Uh, no understand you. Huh? Manifesto. Manifesto say deliver here. Mm. Hey, stop. Where the fuck do you think you're going? Get back out. Get back out. Get back out. I got confused. Uh, God don't speak English. Uh, must have just read the manifesto. manifesto. He said, he said, go here. of all things holy. I, I, I tried to stop it, but it just kept coming and coming. Oh, it's, there, there, Wade. Look, 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 it's a, Betty, you're just not cut out for honest work, all right? Did, did you get what you needed? Yeah, 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 yeah more or less. Yeah, I just got to uh, figure out a place to plan this now. All right, this will do. That woman ain't even fine. Ain't no one understands why Floyd lets her use him so. Oh, that's a uh, low self-esteem, Wade. We got to build him back up. Now. <sighs> and there, perfect. All right, so. Based on my observations, I'd say these Meriwether security cocksnots are sitting on something real valuable. I think they got two of these things, but we only need one. First one is on that freighter in a container below deck. They got guards all over that ship, so it's likely they're keeping it on ice. The air, land, and sea routes into the port will be locked down as soon as we make a noise at these X's here. Which means we have to blow up the ship and grab the thing underwater. Need a guy to plant the bombs, a guy to look out for him with a rifle, and a guy to grab the thing, whatever it is, underwater. That means stealing us a submarine, of course, but you can find us one of them, can't you? Huh? Now, the other one is off the coast being tested. They're running the operation from the dock where I last saw your cousin. We'll need a submarine for that, too, and probably a chopper, a big one. We go out there, look around underwater, locate it, Bring it back here and find out what it is. Here? To the Congo? Aight, so, what do you think? Container ship or whatever's offshore? Oh. 
offshore. Deep sea adventure, gotta be. You and Floyd can help, and we'll bring along Michael and his unpaid intern. You okay, all right. What is that smell? Oh, we are going straight to the local union rep. Yep. Wade here was injured in the performance of his duties. Human waste has seeped into his very pores, and I am sorry to say this, but I don't think he's ever gonna smell normal again. <laughs> you can't go to the union. You are union, all right, and you vouched for us, all right? You look at him, man. Smell him, no. smell him. Uh, Trevor, Trevor, uh, you're, you're planning a robbery on my place of work. You violated Mr. Raspberry Jam, and God alone knows what else. You damaged Deborah. Look, my lady and my union, that's all I got. So why don't we just, uh, why don't we just let this all slide, huh? If you're comfortable with what's happened to your cousin, then so be it, all right? But I would give him a bath and rinse him off. No! No bag! Disloyalty, boy! Disloyalty? What is you talking about? Don't act like you don't know what it is, homeboy, yo. You ain't been to the set, ain't came to none of the meetings. Mm, hanging out with old men, ignoring your homies, acting all superior. Your mama would turn over in her grave, boy. Mm -hmm. So you giving me a lecture about not being a good enough gangbanger? Gangs is positive. That's all we got, my nigga. That's our heritage. Ain't nothing positive about your crazy ass. Man, where's Tanisha at? She got more sense than to hang out with your sorry ass. You know you always been like this, boy. I say left, you say right. I say become a doctor. You say become a patient. I say, who is that? Hello, Missy. Wow, Franklin. You never told me that you had a sister. I'm Denise, Franklin's housemate. And aunt, my mother's old dried up ass shut sister. Shut the fuck up. Yeah, shut the fuck up. Here, darling, why don't you go get yourself Something nice, okay? Oh, thank you. <laughs> is, is it seven dollars? I said something nice, not expensive. You want to be a greedy fucking cow, huh? No. Now get the fuck out of here, all right? You men are all the same. Man, what the fuck you doing here? Here with the boy, the boys. What? I'm fucking new in town. I'm making friends, all right? Now let's party. Look, I had plans on getting some rest until this clown and my aunt came and fucked that up. My nigga, I just came over here to holler at you about the little thing. Man, I said I'm tired, dawg. What fucking thing? I love things. I'm the king of things. I ain't talking to you, homie. Hey, let's go do something about the thing, okay? What thing? I'm talking about the little stress thing, man. Fucking beautiful. Perfect. It's a gangbang. Let's go. Come on. <sighs> come Who on, is this man. fool, man? What is this nigga Man, just come man? on. Courier service. Packets to collect. You got the grip? Present and accounted for. <laughs> you like that, huh? Sample? <laughs> now we talking. <laughs> <laughs> My throat getting numb already. So we good, nigga, right? Well, let's go. How about a taste? No, man, we leaving. I want a taste of the other side of the brick. Now, you heard what your boy said, you're leaving. Hey, give me the... Give me the... Give me the Whoa. What the fuck? Did we ask for a key or a fucking ounce? Man, that's motherfucking drywall. Hey, we got some motherfucking buyer's remorse out here. You can't fucking hustle a hustler! Fuck off! Ah. We are an infinitely intelligent race of supercosmic beings, and out of the six billion people on this planet, we have chosen you for no good reason. And just then, they were about to abduct me and do experiments on me.
when their ship crashed. Man, you done lost your motherfucking mind. And now, I've got to find the pieces. Man, bullshit. Look, look. See this? Hmm? If you see some, if you see some, let me know. Yeah, yeah, okay, I will, man. What's up, man? Sit down and face forward. Now, I don't have a lot of time. I know you need money. Did Michael tell you about Life Invader? Oh, shit. Y'all two did that? Look forward. We're two strangers having a friendly chat. And don't pretend that you liked Jane Norris. Oh, man, I don't know, homie. I mean, yeah, the dude I source worked the child slaves. Then stole and sold everybody's private information. And even ripped his own friend's ideas off and walked around like the Messiah while doing it, but... Man, I don't think the nigga deserved to have his fucking head blowed off on TV. Oh, well, aren't you just a moral majority? You know, that's why the world is the way it is today, when a paid thug gets all namby-pamby when someone asks him to act like a paid thug and for a good cause. Man, check this out, homie. I like blowing motherfucking fools' heads off just as much as the next psychotic asshole. But I just don't look at the shit as doing a good deed. Well, now you can, because it's not fools' heads, it's assholes' heads. And not just heads, you know, trashing cars or planting lies, forging evidence, anything we can do to take the battle back to these turds. You know, we'll fix the market in our favor and we'll right a few wrongs while we're at it. <laughs> shit, okay, cool. Right, so, you heard of Mollus? Hell yeah. Okay, so there's a new mollus, sort of a super mollus, and it's called Priapolds. It's giving the living rigor mortis. Only Brett Lowry, CEO of Bilkington Research, paid off the FDA. Now, he doesn't care that his hardness pills are giving desperate middle-aged men the world over heart attacks. Damn, man, that sucks. Yeah, it does. Now, Mr. Greedy Lowry is staying at the Von Krastenberg Hotel in Richmond. Of course, he'll be well protected, but if he goes away, then America goes back to using mollus, and Beta Pharmaceuticals gets a big bump in the price of their stock. Damn, man, all right, fuck it, I got you. I thought that you would. Now, consider using a sniper rifle or sticky bombs, you know, whatever. Do it your way, however you want. I'm gonna make the investment, we don't speak about this or anything. Now walk away, and I'll stay here till you're gone. Very effective. I'm prepared to be a martyr, friend. Are you? Shit, if being a martyr means to smoke good weed, for sure. Would you like a little warm-up? You know, before you go and collect the supplies? Before I what? You know, get the supplies. Can't have a smoke in without smoke. <laughs> you know, cerebral stuff that's gonna get the people up off their feet protesting. Man, I don't know. It sounds kind of bullshit to me. You know, we're gonna crush them with our resolve. Here. <clears throat> have a little taste of that. <clears throat> Hmm, just a mellow, sophisticated high. Man, this seems a little dry. Can't you see the aliens? Man, what else are you taking? Man, this shit is garbage. Anyway, just get the stuff. It's a revolution. And then call me. Crazy motherfucker. Homie. Hey. Yeah, hey, uh, you seem incredible lately? Yeah, Trevor Phillips, but I doubt if you want a picture of him. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Wasn't he uh, in, in the, the men's room? Nah, nah. Oh, shit. I gotta tell you. This is unbelievable. Ah, crap. That hurt. Man, you're not gonna believe this. They want to do a reality series about me. Yeah, it's true, man. I'm gonna be big. I'm gonna be huge, right? It's all about the incredibly glamorous life I lead. Huh? Oh, good. Yeah, boy. Oh, yeah, boy. Uh, except, you know, while I'm doing that, I'm gonna need somebody else to take some shots for me. Nah, no, no, I'm cool on that, dog. Oh, come on, dude. Come on, homie. Like... All right, look, just if, if you get a chance, right? I mean, there's no rush, okay? Oh, and then what I'll do is I'll, I'll send you a list of names and some links so you can see who they are, right? Uh, yeah, well, whatever, man, all right. Yeah. Hey, you know, and I promise you, fame won't change me one bit. Covered, huh? No, another most important fight. The AIDS. No, no, no another one. Animal welfare. Legalization. Here, sign. Shit, where's my pen? Where's my pen? Legalization of what? Of things the Founding Fathers took as a right. 
to consume medicinal plants. Legalized smoke? Yeah. You fucking kidding me? I make a shitload of money selling that, all right? The last thing I can handle is legalization. Now fuck off! Take a drag. No, I don't, I don't, I don't smoke it anymore. It interferes with the speed. No, it's really good weed. All right, give it here. Yeah. It's a real mellow contemplative high that comes from here. <laughs> Those clowns over there. 